So this is question 13 on practice exam number two. Uh, we have the set of real numbers from zero to one inclusive A and the set of real numbers from negative two to two, uh, not including the real numbers between negative one and one B. And we want to provide a function F that shows that the cardinality of A is less than or equal to the cardinality of B and a function G that shows that the cardinality of A is greater than or equal to the cardinality of B. So in essence, we're showing that the cardinality of these two sets are the same. Um, so for this first step, we can do this in two ways. We can show a function which is one to one from A to B or on two from B to A and vice versa for part B. So one to one from B to A and then on two from A to B. So for the purposes of this question, let's just do a one to one function from A to B. So F goes from A to B uh, and let's use X plus one. So in this case, we're mapping the range zero one to the range one two when we just add one. And this gives us a one to one function. Now for part B, we want a function G which shows that the cardinality of A is greater than or equal to the cardinality of B. So like we said before, we can do this two ways. We can do this as a one to one function from B to A or a onto function from A to B. So, uh, Sticking with the one-to-one -one theme, let's do a one-to-one -one function from B to A. Uh, in this case, if we try and cram this entire range into this range, then we can use the function x plus two divided by four. So we can see that the left or the lower end of the range, uh, negative two plus two divided by four maps to zero. And the upper end of the range two plus two divided by four maps to the upper end of the range one. So we've shown a one-to-one -one function in both directions uh, for each part of this question.